Hey, what's up guys? It's Minfi here and today I'm going to be playing some Modern Warfare 3. For today's video, I'm going to be checking out a brand new game mode added into Modern Warfare 3 called One in the Chamber. Now this game mode technically isn't brand new. It was in Black Ops 1 originally in major matches and I used to play One in the Chamber but I was never good at it but I had a lot of fun playing it nonetheless. Black Ops 1 was basically my first introduction to Call of Duty multiplayer and if I played anything before that, it's basically not in my brain because I was just way too young back then. But my core memory of starting Call of Duty was within Black Ops 1. So yeah, I'm really excited about this game mode being in Modern Warfare 3 since it's been a hot minute since I played One in the Chamber. And I guess with that being said, I am going to go ahead and give her some One in the Chamber. One thing that I remember about this game mode is back then you would have to wait your COD points for it and I feel like I lost all my COD points back then because I was a dingus and I didn't know how to play the game mode, at least very well because it was like my first time really playing Call of Duty multiplayer and I was just not that great at it. So I feel like I lost all my COD points. Thankfully in Modern Warfare 3 it seems like there's no wagering your COD points so you won't actually lose anything. Thing. You'll basically just lose the match and just go on to your next one like nothing ever happened. Unless it somehow happens to be on your KD, then it ends up on your permanent record. And then Mrs. Puff will come after you, saying it's on your permanent record. Whatever this is, it's going on your permanent record. I am so excited. I got one in a chamber on high rise. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. I am nervous. I'm probably gonna die instantly because I'm a skill issue. Will it show me where they are? There won't be a UAV sweep. Okay, so I'm pretty sure someone's gonna be over here. Yep, I saw someone there. Ooh. 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 I shot. This is what happens. I hesitate. Oh, I shouldn't run. I can hear my boots. Ooh. Yay. <laughs> oh. <gasps> that wasn't very nice. I think. I'm almost gone, by the way, because I died twice already. I'm gone. I missed my shot. All right, so we have this guy. We have... Who else? We have this guy. Oh, he sees him. Are you gonna take the shot? One shot, one opportunity, quite literally. Oh, there's another person there. All right. <laughs> All right, smooth. Oh, someone else just died. Oh, there he is. Oh, they both missed. It was going to be a fist fight. <laughs> Oh, he got him. Also, yes, I did place an eighth. I guess some things just never change, you know? Back then, I think like 10 plus years ago, I was really bad at one in a chamber. To this day, in 2024, I am still very bad at one in a chamber. Okay, after saying that, I actually am curious. When did Black Ops 1 come out? November 9th, 2010? Huh? Huh? No, seriously, it came out in 2010. Wait, what? That was 14 years ago. This... What? Oh my... I'm thinking about that, and I'm just thinking... Holy cow, that's a long time ago. I think it broke my brain. I shouldn't have found that out. That was a really long time ago. Which also, side note, I knew one day I would grow up, so one thing I would do is I would save my GameStop receipts in my cases of the games that I would buy, and I still have my original Modern Warfare 2 CD disc and stuff. I still have my Black Ops 1 and 2 disc, and my DS games and all that. It's pretty neat looking back at that stuff. Obviously, the ink has faded, but like, it's pretty neat to kind of have that memorabilia, essentially. Anyways, aside from that, I am gonna go ahead and give her some more one in the chamber, and hopefully I do better. I highly doubt I would because again I'm just terrible and I proved to you guys in that last match that I'm terrible so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and try again real quick okay so I got some DOS house I wonder if this is a mid-match oh goodness gracious it is oh god I'm scared wait is everyone dead oh yeah it's just me and this other person I got scared I jumped I get too like scared on here I get twitchy Nice. Oof. Oh no. I'm already doing significantly better than I was earlier. I will say that. I could have just easily eaten my words, by the way. Oh, I got him. Look at that. I feel like an NPC because I'm just kind of like roaming around. Ooh, got him again. Awesome. I have one life remaining. BT dubs. Oh, it's NS new people. Come back. No, oh my god, that was just terrible. Anyways, I'm out. I did end up getting six kills in that, so that's pretty great. Come on, Douglas. I believe in- oh wait, no. You missed your shot, Douglas. Now you have to use your fists, Douglas. He's behind you, Douglas. You missed, Douglas! How did you miss that? 
that. Oh my god. You know what? I shouldn't even be giving him criticism because I did so bad in my first match. It's okay, Douglas. Is he out? Oh my god, he's been eliminated. I think he's straight up gone. Also, this is one of those matches that just have an infinite fill. I died like a hot minute ago. This guy joined in late and has been destroying everyone. Poor Douglas had to die to him. I'm gonna find a new match. Anyways, I did do significantly better in that last match. I did end up getting six kills before I did get eliminated. So that is good. That is definitely better than two kills. So that being said, I am gonna go ahead and queue up for another match of one in the chamber. All right, let's see if I can do better. Awesome, already, first blood. <gasps> you go away. Oh. Oh no, I lost my shot. I'm gonna wait this door because I need to melee. And I'm scared. <gasps> oh. Oh, you have to melee too. Ooh! That was weird aim assist. So I'm doing better. What was any of that? Uh oh. Ooh. Oh no! I died. I finally died. Bye bye. You know, there is one person that I absolutely loved watching play one in the chamber when I was younger. I'd come home from school and I would watch their Let's Plays on Black Ops 1. Oh god, I missed. I don't know why I go for those shots because I know I'm gonna miss. Aw, I'm done so. I have been eliminated. But yeah, there's like one person that I used to watch all the time when I would come home from school that would be playing one in a chamber or just like Nuketown or really just Black Ops 1 in general. But basically this YouTuber would basically upload COD content regularly. It was just really fun because they'd talk about their life and stuff that was happening around them. And they would basically do like their gameplay commentary stuff. It was just very interesting to watch. In 2010 version of YouTube was significantly different than what we have now because I didn't even look up this person person's YouTube channel. It was basically recommended to me at that time and I just had a lot of fun watching his content. You got this. You know what to do. No shot, no kill. Won't even see it coming. You just gotta knife him. Come on. Oh, hey, I got second place. Look at that. I'm so happy about that. Okie dokie. I am on some dust house. This guy just spawned. Everyone slides around. Meanwhile, me, I just exist. <laughs> See, I just exist, even though I did just die. Also, side note, my allergies hate me. I have been like coughing a lot and like sneezing a lot. It has been very painful. I am on my last life. Let's see if I can get anyone or if I will just die instantly. Woohoo! You missed your shot. Na 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 boo boo, na na boo boo. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha, I won. And by that, I mean I got second place. <laughs> Wait, how did that not hit me though? <laughs> it showed the mag dump in the tea bag. Well, after getting that kill cam and also placing second place in that last match, I will say I'm pretty satisfied with how my matches went today. I definitely had a lot of fun playing one in a chamber today. And also on a side note, I definitely did not improve from 2010 to 2014 in one in a chamber specifically. I am still very bad at that game mode. I think I just got lucky several times today. But I'm not gonna lie, I am pretty happy with how my matches went and especially getting second place in that last match. That was really nice. I am very happy about that. I do wish I could have placed first in one of them, but I'm just not that good. Also, I would like to mention that I am happy that we are getting party games in Modern Warfare 3 already. We're currently already in Season 3, which is halfway through Modern Warfare 3 cycle. I'm comparing it between last year's Modern Warfare 2 game, which had six seasons. So basically, if this game has six seasons, then we're already halfway done with this game. That's kind of how I'm looking at it, if that makes sense. But anyway, since we are halfway done with Modern Warfare 3's life cycle, I do hope we get more party games moving forward, and I think One in a Chamber was the perfect way to start it off. And I do know that we already have infection and whatnot, but I don't technically consider that a party game mode, even though it technically is, but to me it just doesn't feel the same because we see infection so often versus one in a chamber or sticks and stones. That's not something you see typically, I feel like. And if they do decide to bring in more party games, please bring in Prop Hunt. That is so fun and I absolutely loved it in Black Ops 4. It was my favorite game mode in BO4 and I just want to see Prop Hunt again. But anyways, with all that being said, I am going to go ahead and end my video here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play One in a Chamber today. I had a lot of fun checking it out. Let me know what you guys think of One in a Chamber so far. Do you guys like it? Do you guys dislike it? I would love to know in the comments down below. But anyways, with all that being said, I am going to go ahead and wrap things up here. So with that being said, I hope you guys have a fantastic day and other evening. Take it easy and peace. Bye.